Welcome inside the Naxor Center. It is the Silver Lake Wranglers taking on the Statler Lightning tonight. Stephen Arthur makes his way back in between the pipes for his second start of the campaign, trying to get the Wranglers back on track after dropping two of their last three. Davin Nadestat makes the start. No surprise here for Stettler. Stettler off to a real, a real uh, tough start, uh, but have since won their last two, including a victory over the Mountain View Colts, who at the time were perfect. So uh, the game is now underway. And Austin Jacobson has it in the neutral zone. Gives up for Houston. He got crushed. And now back the other way come the Wranglers. Early opportunity for Sylvan Lake. But knocked off the puck. Jacobson got it up to Dylan Houston again. Houston. He is attacking the line. He comes in. Sylvan Lake wants an offside call. They're not going to get one. Fournier shot it through a sea of people. And a good stop. Here come the Wranglers back the other way. Here's Caleb Bird. Berg stopping, Ryder shooting that one. It goes to Matt Sylvester. And Sylvester will come in offensively for the Statler Lightning. Sylvester looking out front. It's going to be knocked away. And here comes Caleb Berg for Sylvan Lake. With it here, Shooter takes a hard hit. Houston's got it tied up on the near side boards. Into the middle. Knocked down by Brett Weston. Weston. That's it right in front of the Silver Lake bench into the middle boat and Ryder now comes up to Caleb Byrne. Byrne with it, gave it up to Wade Lightburn. Lightburn up to Weston. Weston centering past here in Rost. Comes back the other way for the Bulls. He gets knocked off the puck. Zach Daniels has it in his own zone. He'll start out, gave it to Shooter. Dylan Shooter knocked off the puck, centered. It's West Brett Daniels. Sorry, Zach Daniels. Now Caleb shooting, glove save by Nadistad. And he will make the save and hold on to that. Three minutes and 47 seconds have come and gone here in the first period here in Sylvan Lake. Draw one here by the Stetler Lightning. It will come up to Eric Ross, and Ross carries in offensively as uh, the Stetler Lightning have been pretty good since they put the Ross, uh, not <laughs> I was going to say Ross triplets. Uh, I didn't mean actual triple say that. I was just trying to say the Ross Trio is what I meant to say as uh, all three brothers playing on a line as now here comes Tucker in the third line out there for Statler. Meanwhile, as I was talking myself in circles, Davin Natastad actually had to make a pretty big save, but Key and Bowen will come out now for Sylvan Lake. Bowen in offensively. That may, might have looked offside, but here's Caleb right in front. They score! Ooh, that was close, I think, at the line, but it doesn't matter. Kyle Richmond scores for the Silver Lake Wranglers, and it's 1-0. Richmond, I believe that's his fourth of the year. And they love it here at Nexorce. Silver Lake's got a 1-0 lead, 5-0. 37 into the hockey game. As Brendan Tucker has it off the draw. Drew Cassidy got it up to Jonathan Fournier. Cassidy's got it back. Now Tucker. Tucker in offensively. Tripped up. Stetler going to go to the man advantage. He'll have an opportunity to get this thing back even. As Cody Wold is going to head off for tripping. Wold was uh, got a stick into the wrong spot there. Is a power play here for Statler. First power play of the evening. Comes six minutes and seven seconds in. Jacobson, far side, one time drive, they score! Ty Mulgrove, first of the year, and he's tied the hockey game at one. It's Mulgrove from Austin Jacobson and Brendan Tucker. And the Statler Lightning who start out to a real tough start here in HJHL 21, but in the last two games, they beat the Mountain View Colts, who at the time were perfect. Three to two in overtime. Then they laid the boots a little bit to Pinoca at home ice. Pinoca, remember, you know, they've never been the strongest team in the Heritage League, but earlier this uh, evening, defeated the Airdrie Thunder. So, 
it's, things are maybe starting to click a little bit here as the Ross trio out there now, Kieran, Eric, and Ethan. And uh, Wagner will take this one in and put it in deep. Power play goal, and the Bolts have tied this thing back up early on the previous power play. Garrity now to Peyton Wright. Wright trying to get over the line. Peyton Wright shoots it. Stopped by Mattestad, and he will hold on. Face off to the right side here of Davin Natastad. He won it, and he won it cleanly. Back to the point, Jackson Ryder. Lavallee now, Garrity, Ryder off the line. Cody Wold, Peyton Wright, up top, Ryder. Ryder now, Garrity. Garrity got a shot away, but it got blocked, and Drew Cassidy will get this one up the near side to Riley Jacobson. Jacobson comes in. Jacobson, nifty move. Jacobson in the middle. Jacobson shoots, and it goes wide. Jeff Turnay back to the line, held in though, and Jacobson's got it again. His shot got blocked. Jackson Ryder finds himself back in the lineup here. It'll go in deep. Gathered here by uh, Andrew Bowman for Stetler. Up the far side, Jeff Turnay. Turnay in offensively for the Bulls. Right up front to Riley Jacobson. He got crushed by Cody Wold, and Wold will start out for Sylvan Lake. Wold in, Wold shooting. That goes up off the mask of Davin Natastad, and now we'll come to Jeff Turnay. Turnay will put this one in deep. 10 minutes, 15 seconds gone he, uh, to play here in this first period, tied up at one. Austin Jacobson in the neutral zone for Stetler. Jacobson, nifty move. Jacobson right out front, one-time drive, and a good save by Stephen Arthur. Here come the Sylvan Lake Wranglers, but it's taken away by Ty Mulgrove. And Mulgrove pitched off there, held up on the line, put in deep here by the Sylvan Lake Wranglers. Gathered out here, though. Here comes Jonathan Fournier. Fournier lets one go from a long way out. Good stop by Stephen Arthur. He is going to hold on. Faceoff will come deep in Wrangler territory. A big hit there after the shot. Take a shot to give it to, to get one, I guess. Face off to the right side of Arthur. Austin Caleb out there against Dylan Houston, and Caleb will win it cleanly. And Houston puts a bump on his man on the far side. Bowden Ryder now to Tate Optin Grease. Optin Grease knocked off the puck. He's going to go over to the far side. Tristan Nixon. Now Sylvester, Sylvester, he got knocked down. Tate Optin Drees, Brett Weston shoots it, blocker save. Held it at the line by Ryder, couldn't get a shot away. Optin Drees will from the slot. Great save, Houston got run over. And I'm surprised there's not more of a reaction from Stetler uh, on that one. As Houston went right to the bench, here's a chance shot, save, rebound, covered up by Arthur. He won't hold on, he gives to Austin Caleb, and now Braden Weston. Now it's Kieran Ross, stops up, he spins away. Knocks his man off the puck, Bowden Ryder, and Ryder into the middle for Braden Weston. Weston, at the far side, Caleb Bird, nifty spin move, tries to get it in the middle, take it away here by Justin Fournier. Justin Fournier, a couple of games ago, go overtime hero in Didsbury, Fournier. Knocked off the puck, he's got it right back. Fournier still, up top, Ross. He shoots it, and I didn't see how that even got on net, but uh, good save to be aware there by Stephen Arthur. Is this puck will come deep into Stetler territory, gathered here by Wagner, but it's turned over. Weston to the line, Daniels turned over, now maybe a break for turn A. Great recovery there by Bowden Ryder. Garrity found Daniels. Daniels can't get a shot away. Comes to the near side. Garrity shoots. Stop by Nanestad. Great save on Davin Nanestad in tight. On Sloan Garrity. Finally, uh, get a whistle here. And oh, that stop by Nanestad there. It came off a stick. Peyton Wright out there. Kale of Alley and Sloan Garrity. Brendan Bardwell, Jeff Turnay, and Riley Jacobson for the Bolts. Comes up to Jeff Turnay on the far side. 
Trenet gains center, now right in the slot. Taken away there by Peyton Wright. Kean Bowen has control for the Sylvan Lake Wranglers. The captain, Playford, to Sloan Garrity. Garrity knocks his man off. Garrity knocked off the puck, though. And now here comes Brendan Tucker. Tucker got knocked off the puck by the captain, Dayton Playford. Into the middle, it's Kean Bowen. Bowen poked off the puck. It's at the line, held in narrowly by the Wranglers. Richmond will put it in deep. Gathered here, Austin Bowman over to the far side, Drew Cassidy, and now here comes Ty Mulgrove. Mulgrove through center. Mulgrove into the middle. Mulgrove can't get a shot away. A penalty is coming up. It will go against the Statler Lightning. So vacating the net for the extra attacker here is Stephen Arthur. It's touched up. So late in the first, Ty Mulgrove is going to go for tripping. Mulgrove uh, got the stick in between the legs there of Cody Wold, and that'll get you every time, just about. Face off, left side of Davin Natistad. One here, Richmond shoots it. Off the draw wide. Optum Dries out front, taken away here by Eric Rost, and flung the length of the ice. We are in the final minute here of. The opening 20 minutes, Bowden Ryder will come through center. Ryder over the line on the far side. Right in the middle, shot, save rebound, Richmond to Optum Dries. Optum Dries to the line, Wade Lightburn taken away from him by Rost, and Rost will put it the length of the ice again. 20 seconds to go in the period. Stretch pass finds Dylan Shooter. Shooter around, Shooter in, fake shoots in, it goes wide. Fournier down the ice. That'll do it for the opening 20 minutes. Sylvan Lake will carry 45, 45 seconds or so uh, to the second of power play time. 1-1 one, one through 20 here in Sylvan Lake. There's the Wranglers. They do strike first. It's Kyle Richmond. But the Statler Lightning get one of their own on the power play, and it's a rocket. No chance for Stephen Arthur there. 1-1 after 20 minutes. Nine seven are the shots on goal in favor of the hometown Wranglers. Welcome back inside Next Source Center. So when late 45 seconds of power play time remains, chance to get the lead back. Caleb Berg on the draw against Brendan Bardwell, and Berg won it cleanly back to Bowden Ryder. Ryder knocked off the puck, and Fournier flung it the length of the ice. And out of his own zone, getting it is Brett Braden Weston. Weston to Lightburn, Lightburn up to Dylan Schooner. Schooner, he's just going to put this one in deep. Gathered by Cassidy, though, off the glass, down the ice, and that should pretty well do it. As Stetler will be back to even strength. Here comes Braden Weston through center. What a move. Weston, shooter, shoots it. The blocker save made by Davin Natastad. Great stop, Natastad. Here's Justin Fournier. Fournier to Ty Mulgrove. Mulgrove over to the far side. Dylan, uh, Matt Sylvester. Sylvester tied up in the corner there. And it's dug loose by Caleb Berg over to the far side. Braden Weston now. Weston knocked off the puck. Houston tied up. It comes loose for Brett Weston. Weston in over the line. Trying to center that one. Couldn't. Here comes Ty Wagner. Wagner centering pass to Tate Optendries. Uh, that was intercepted. And now it's Caleb. Caleb off the wall. One timer in front got blocked. It's Tate Optendries. Another one timer. That one whistled wide. Hard hit there on Wagner. But here comes Jacobson. Jacobson over to the near side for Rost. Rost. Jacobson now up to Matt Sylvester. Sylvester puts it down into the corner. Ethan Rost. Rost shooting blocked. Rost has it back. Ross, Sylvester, he couldn't get it around. Steven Arthur, he makes the save and holds on to that. Four minutes thereabouts gone here in this second period. Sylvan Lake one, Stetler one. Ethan, Eric, and Kieran Ross out there for the Bulls. It is Bennett, Richmond, Bowen for the, for the Wranglers. Now a one-timer from the line got blocked. Ethan Ross trying to center it. That was Eric, excuse me, looking for Ethan, but 
didn't get there, and now here comes Zach Daniels. Daniels over the line. Daniels looking for a shooting lane. He gets one. He fired it just wide. Is Here is Ethan Ross to Bowman. Bowman now looking through center. Comes over the line. Bowman looking to get a shot away. Cannot do so. And Kean Bowen takes back the other way. Bowen for the Wranglers in front. St. Bennett shot it. And a good stop made by Natistad. Drew Cassidy. He's with it there on the far side. Knocked off the puck. Cassidy tied up in the far side. Key and Bowen. And now Peyton Wright in behind the goal for the Wranglers. Wright shoots it. Great save, Natistad. It's still loose. Wright still got it in behind the net. In there to help dig it out is Kyle Richmond. It'll come over to the near side. Eric Ross got it to Andrew Bowman. Bowman got it to Tucker, and the Lightning will try to attack here. Here's Ty Mulgrove. Mulgrove, he's got it here on the left. But it's tied up now in the corner. Jackson Wright are in on it for the Bull for the Wranglers. Here comes Kale Valley out. Lavalley looking up ice. He found Sloan Garrity. Garrity shooting. It goes just wide. Now it's Lavalley up top. Lightburn. Ryder over to the far side. Lavalley. Lavalley looking to get a shot away. Cannot do so. And Jeff Turney will come back the other way for the Bolts. Turney knocked off the puck. Here is Eric Rost. Ross in the middle, turn A. It's Ty Mulgrove. He shot it at a good save. Made point blank by Stephen Arthur. Still 1-1 approaching the midway point of the hockey game. Bowden Ryder knocked off the puck with ease by Austin Jacobson. And now turn A over to the far side, Bardwell. Bardwell right in the slot. Bardwell pestered there by Braden Weston. Good defensive play by Weston. And now the Wranglers have it in their own zone. Here comes Berg. Caleb Berg knocked off the puck neatly. It'll come back into Statler territory. Gathered by Austin Jacobson on the near side. In the middle for Bardwell. Bardwell up the near side boards. It'll come to Jeff Turnay. Turnay got run over. It goes in deep. This is Brett Weston tied up here by Riley Jacobson. And a hard hit now in the corner as the bodies start to fly everywhere. And you wonder if this thing might blow up here with the fight or two if the hits keep coming at the rate that they are. Is we saw a couple of scraps in the Airdrie and uh, Sylvan Lake game. Uh, that was at the Ron Emerson Arena on Tuesday. It was Weston in the corner. Weston tied up by Fournier. Doug Lee Sylvester. Sylvester, he's still got the puck. Trying to kick this one off ice. Cannot do so. Riley Jacobson in his own zone for the Bolts. Wheel starts out the far side. Comes up to Dylan Houston. Houston. Two couple of moves. Houston. He drives right in. He shoots. He scores. Dylan Houston. Highlight real goal. Top shelf tally. Houston six of the year from Riley Jacobson. It's 2-1 Statler. Backed up. Jackson Ryder and then just shelved it. 200 plus HJHL goals for Dylan Houston and that's why. The Statler captain. Has gotten the bolts a 2-1 lead here with seven minutes and change to go in this second period. Jackson Ryder, he comes over the line. Now Bowen trying to tie it. A blocker was saved by Davin Natistat. Put in deep, Kyle Richmond up top. Jackson Ryder, Ryder, Richmond, side of the net. Good stop by Natistat in tight there. Here comes Matt Sylvester back the other way for the Bulls. Sylvester, he's got Quaid Cassidy to the net. Now he's in behind the goal, Cassidy. Wade Cassidy trying to dig that one out. Sylvester can't do so. The Wranglers will come out with it. Here's Kyle Richmond through center on the far side. Richmond makes a nifty move. He's got it back. A good stop by Natastad. Kicked it out with the right pad. Five minutes to go here. Second period. 2-1. Statler leads on the road in Sylvan Lake. Brendan Tucker over the line far side. Knocked off the puck. Tucker. He backhands this one toward the goal. Good stop by Steven Arthur. And he is going to hold on to that. Four minutes, 23 seconds. That's what's left here in the second period. Dylan Houston. He's got the go-ahead goal. 
for the Statler Lightning. Looking to make it three in a row after a real tough start to the campaign. And the draw won by the Lightning, but the Wranglers have it right back. Garrity got it to Lightburn, and Lightburn skates out. Lightburn on the far side. Lightburn, he's looking for options. He finds the Valley, but the Valley couldn't get the shot away from the point blank range. And now here come the Bolts back in. This is Jonathan Fournier. Fournier steps in. He's onside. Ross out front. Save the rebound. Tucker hit the post. Here's Fournier. Fournier in the corner. Tucker knocked off the puck. Ross shooting. Tucker shot it. Got blocked. Here is Braden Weston. Back the other way for the Sylvan Lake Wranglers. Weston got crunched pretty hard. And now here comes Wade Lightburn. Lightburn in offensively. Lightburn shooting. Good blocker save turned in there by Natastad. Is here are the bolts stretch pass. Here is Eric Rost. Rost has a lot of room. Rost in can't get a shot away. Pestered at the last second, and it rolls wide. Here comes Dylan Shooter. Now 90 seconds to go in the second. Berg forehand he goes back to the backhand. Can't get a shot away. Drew Cassidy had him played perfectly. Cassidy goes up to Ethan Rost. Rost to the near side. Kieran, his brother Kieran, takes it into the near side corner. Zach Daniels out front to Dayton Playford. Now comes up the far side to Tate Often Grease. Often Grease knocked off the puck. Fournier got it to Brendan Bardwell. And Bardwell will attack for the Bolts. Bardwell drives his man back. He shoots and great stop by Arthur. Arthur standing tall on that one with nine seconds to play here. Arthur holds on to it for the draw. It was nearly 3 1 Bolts there. But Brennan Tucker put a rebound with a wide open cage off the iron. Draw to the right side of Stephen Arthur. And one in control. It's going to be a one time drive from the line. And that puck blockered into the corner. That'll do it. This second period has come to a close. Statler has a 2 1 lead. 20 minutes from three in a row. as the Statler Lightning on this beauty by Dylan Houston make it 2-1 20 to go here at Nexorms shot 16-13 in favor of the Silver Lake Wranglers but the Wranglers do trail by a one goal margin 2-1 Statler leads Houston and Berg on the draw as the Wranglers will try to avoid back-to-back -back losses for the first time in HJHL 21. And the Stettler Lightning trying to make it three in a row. Touched up, and this is not what you want. If you're a Sylvan Lake Wrangler, an early penalty against, it'll go against Caleb Berg. And he just got the stick kind of in between the feet there of Justin Fournier. Is uh, we will get a power play opportunity for Stettler. Eth Eric and Kieran Rost out there with Dylan Houston. One for one with one shot. The Stettler Lightning on the power play. Second shot goes high and wide. Here is Rost. Now on front to Dylan Houston. He ripped it high and wide. No shots there on that sequence. It'll go the full 200. Cleared there by the Wranglers. 19.20 to go in the frame. Stretch pass, Houston. Houston will just put this in deep. He was bare down on there. Dayton play for the captain. will get this off the glass and out. Here is Matt Sylvester. We're trading in behind his own goal. It will come up the near side for Eric Ross. Ross gets knocked off the puck. Brennan, this is Kieran Ross. They'll try to tie it up on the near sideboards. Houston's got it. Houston shooting, save, rebound, loose in front. And it's clear to the corner. Bowden Ryder down the ice. 40 seconds to go on the Statler man advantage. This will be a this is an important kill here, make no mistake, for the Sylvan Lake Wranglers. Knocked off the puck, it's at the line, held in, Sylvester. Sylvester, Houston at the side of the goal. Great defensive play by Lightburn. Wranglers clear, and that should get him back to even strength. Is just a couple of seconds left. Here's Eric Ross. We are back to five on five. And now poked off the puck. This puck came right by Berg. If Berg were a foot or two up uh, into a better spot, it would have been a breakaway. But instead, here come the... Bolts back the other way. Ethan Ross knocked off the puck. Brett Weston's got it, but he turned it over to Ross. 
Now Sylvester. Sylvester taking off the puck by off the Drees. Got it up to Brent Weston. Weston shooting glove. Stopped by Nadistad. And Gavin Nadistad will hold on. Three and a half gone here in this third period. 2-1. Statler leads. Steven Arthur, you see there, making a big stop. Right side here of Gavin Nadistad. The draw. Rost to line out there for Stetler. Here's Zach Daniel shooting. Glove save through traffic made by Natastad. Had to be sharp there. Brett Weston on the doorstep. Nothing there. Sixteen seventeen to go here in this period. 10-7 the draws favor the Stetler Lightning, and the Lightning will win that draw as well. Here is Austin Jacobson, or Riley Jacobson, excuse me, trying to get this in deep. Cannot do so. Here come the Sylvan Lake Wranglers. With it here is Optin Dries. Optin Dries in the slot. He gets a shot away. It's blocked by Riley Jacobson. Now back to the line. Dayton Playford holds. It's Caleb in the slot. He shoots. He scores! Great shot, Caleb! It's 2-2! Uh, you see there the new mascot for the Wranglers. I named him Foxy because I was told that a young uh, man named Brett Fox is the off-ice captain for the Wranglers. I don't know what that is, but it sounds important, so he better be the mascot. And he is. He, yeah, it's just a huge goal. And Foxy had a big part to do with that. 2-2 two -two here. Caleb from Weston and Playford. And that has us even with 15 to go. Jeff Turnay, hard shot on the far side from Zach Daniels. And now here's Caleb Byrne. Top line out there for Sylvan. Here comes Zach Daniels. Silver line, far side. Right in front, Berg shoots it. Great save. Closing the five hole up. That was Gavin Natistad. Riley Jacobson over to the far side. Mulgrove comes in offensively for Statler. Knocked off the puck. Brendan Tucker. Tucker, he got poked loose. And now a break. Dylan Shooter by himself. Backhander stopped by Natistad. Kicked it out with the left pad. And now two on two the other way. Fournier. Fournier looking in front. Couldn't get it there. Cody Wold take it away. Wold to Shooter. Shooter denied moments ago on the breakaway. Went to the backhand. Now Weston is. Weston's got it. Uh, nothing. Whistle goes. Penalty on Sylvan Lake. Caleb Byrne, second penalty of the period. Little too trigger happy on the poke check. Tripping penalty. Wranglers go to the penalty kill. Chance here for the Bolts to gain the lead right back. 12.37 to go. That's not the way you want to start if you want to get the lead back. Clear immediately by the Wranglers. Here's Kieran Ross. Ross leaves it Cassidy. Houston, near side. He got a shot away from a sharp angle. And a good save in tight by Arthur. This puck set the length of the edge. 12 minutes to go in the third period. A buck 23 on the power play for Stetler. Five forwards for the Bolts. Not paying dividends there. Cleared again by Sylvan Lake. 2-2. Here is Matt Sylvester. Through center. Sylvester over the line. Far side. Sylvester stopping up into the middle. Taking away Key and Bowen. Guess what? The full 200. Down the ice it goes. 39 seconds remaining on the kill for Sylvan Lake. Ty Mulgrove is the Bolts change the power play unit. Here comes a Tucker. Mulgrove right up front. Toe save. Left pad made by Arthur. Tucker. Mulgrove shooting. Loose puck. Bardwell. Jacobson from the line. Blocker save. Arthur. Now Bardwell centering pass. He'll come in behind the net. Ty Mulgrove in shooting. He couldn't get a shot away. We're back to even strength. Sylvester. He tried to get this one in deep, but it's taken away by Berg, who's out of the box. Half a period to play. 2 2. Silver. Lake and Stetler. Now it's Caleb. He is tripped up and look out. The Wranglers will get a power play of their own and a chance to, ta to take the lead. Bardwell will go for tripping. Tripped up Austin Caleb.
Schoenert, Berg, Weston, the power play unit for the Sylvan Lake Wranglers. One by the Wranglers. Here's Berg. Berg near side. Weston's got it back to Daniels. Caleb Berg up top, Bennett. Here's Berg again. Berg back to the line. Daniels far side. Now to the near side. Braden Weston shot. Blocked. And Braden Weston, in his haste to keep that puck alive, commits a stick infraction there. Well, not a stick infraction, actually, but a, uh, an obstruction infraction, I should say. Hooking against Braden Weston. And we are going to play four on four for a buck 36. And then Statler are going to get a 24 second power play. Draw one by the Bolts. Sylvester slot. Couldn't get a shot away. Zach Daniels has it. Daniels up to Dayton Playford. Playford starts through center. Playford steps around a couple of guys. Playford, nifty move out front. Weston, he rang it off the mask at Devin Adestad. But it stays out. Dylan Houston poked off his stick. Justin Fournier back. Fournier turns that one over, and now Zach Daniels in the West End. West End, Bennett, whose shot got blocked. It's going to come loose to Austin Jacobson, who turns this one over. But uh, fortunately for Stetler, this is going to be able to get out. But here come the Wranglers right back in a another penalty. 36 seconds to go on the original Stetler penalty. So it'll be four on three for 36. Then we'll go back to four on four, and then it'll end up five on four, Sylvan Lake. But a four on three power play, which most will tell you is more dangerous than a five on four, or even a five on three. And now here's Burke. Burke shooting! Goes wide. Shooter in the corner. 27 seconds to go. Burke. He couldn't get this one, and it's turned back for Jeff Turnay. Turnay, he got knocked off the puck. Turnay's got it still, though. Turnay, good battle level. Richmond over to the near side, Optendries. So the Statler Lightning get a man out of the box here. 20 seconds to go, four on four. Berg, Berg shooting. That gets blocked, and it's going to go way up and way out of play. 15 seconds, four on four remains. They're tied up at two here at the next door center in Sylvan Lake. I don't know where you, would you call that downtown Sylvan Lake? Is there a downtown Sylvan Lake? I, I'm not trying to trip, I love Sylvan. Parents got a place there, it's a good time. Here is Nixon back the other way. I just don't know if you'd call it downtown. Here's Houston. Houston now into the middle. Is it's going to be taken away by the Wranglers. They're on a power play now. Five on four of that variety for 38 seconds. Bird shoots it. Shooter right in front, but he has it poked off his stick by Natastad. Ethan Ross. He's going to get this one out, try to get it in deep camp the first time, but he got it right back. Ross into the middle. Wagner couldn't get a shot away. Here's Austin Kayla. 10 seconds to go in the Wrangler power play, and then we're back to five on five. Six and a half to go here in the third period. Stetler able to kill it. And another power play coming. And this one will go to Stetler. So this third period, the back half of it, plagued by all kinds of penalties to both sides. Chance for a kill here. Braden Weston is off for tripping. As the Bolts will try to take the lead with Kieran, Eric, and uh, Kieran and Eric Rost out there, as well as Dylan Houston, the captain. But the Wranglers, as they've started every penalty kill, started with a draw win and a clear the length of the ice. Riley Jacobson in over the line for Statler. Cuts to the middle, to the near side, neatly taken away by Dayton Playford and flung the length of the ice again. Austin Jacobson up the wall, Rost. Now we're to his brother, Eric. Eric Ross starts in. Ross knocked off the puck, but Kieran's there to help out. Back to the line, Austin Jacobson. Jacobson, Houston, fighting, shooting, rebound, Kieran Ross scores! Kieran Ross has scored a power play goal for the Statler Lightning. Dylan Houston and Austin Jacobson get the assist. And Statler has taken a 3-2 lead. And all those penalties, you thought one of them had to bite somebody. Good fake, and that's a beauty. That's an absolute beauty. Dylan Houston, watch it here. 21 in white. He's going to get it. He fakes. He fires. That gets Herbert down the first time. 
then he, when he shoots it, there's no way Herbert can recover for the rebound. And I don't know if they're going to come much easier for Kieran Rost who scores what may well stand up as the winner and give the Statler Lightning three consecutive HJHL victories and hand the Wranglers two consecutive HJHL defeats. But there's still time to go. Berg over to the far side. Shooter, fire, save, rebound, Berg! Oh my goodness, Donestad got there a split second before Caleb Berg. Berg was inches from tying this thing. Draws 13 aside. That one won by Sylvan Lake. Jackson Ryder from the line hammered. There's Caleb. Often Dries shoots it. Doesn't get through. Now here comes Bowman. Four minutes to go in the third period. A one goal. Statler Lightning lead. Bowman drops off for Rost. Rost can't get a shot away. It comes to Kieran Rost. Right out front. Great save by Arthur. Here is Wold. Wold now got it to. Brett Weston. Weston comes in. Just over three to play. Weston can't get the shot away. That was a change up and kind of handcuffed Natastad, but he's able to recover and hold on to that. Kieran Ross nearly got a second uh, in a couple of minutes, but a great stop in tight by Stephen Arthur. Keeps this a one goal game. 3-0-2 to go in the third period. Face off. Right side of Devin Natastad. It's one control by the Silver Lake Wranglers. Bobbled there by Kean Bowen, but Bowen maintains control now. Can't get a shot away. Leiper comes in. He will. He shot it wide. Two and a half to play here in the period. Austin Jacobson, he's got it in his own zone for Stetler. Into the middle for Brendan Tucker. Tucker uh, rags the puck, steps around a couple of guys, and it will come eventually back into Wrangler control in the neutral zone. Here's Kean Bowen. Bowen now, here's Riley Jacobson, tied up on the far side. It's gonna come loose for Ty Mulgrove. Mulgrove, he got stepped into pretty hard there. Minute to go here, we'll keep an eye on Stephen Arthur. It's Zane Bennett to Richmond. Richmond looking in front, can't find a man. Richmond still up the near side boards. That's Love Alley to Bennett. Bennett shoots it, stopped by Natastad, and he will hold on. And with that, Stephen Arthur is going to vacate the Wrangler goal. Foxy cheering the boys on. Hoping for an equalizer late. 46.4 to go. Six on five, Sylvan Lake. Draw one by the Lightning. And it will come up the near side, but held in by Playford. Playford, shooter. Shooter, Garrity, Lavalli. Oh, what a stop by Donestad. Daniels from the line. His shot got blocked. Jeff Turnay, he will put this in deep, and it will be gathered in behind their empty net by the Wranglers. Shooter starts back the other way. Statler stacking up the blue line, but the Wranglers gained the line anyway. Lavalli shoots it. Stop by Donestad. Down to 20.8 seconds to go. 3-2, Statler leads. Sylvan Lake with an empty net. Face off right side of Davin Natastad, one, and here is Sylvester. He's gonna take a pop at the empty net. It gets blocked, and here come the Wranglers back the other way. Tate Optendries. Now to Wold. Wold's got it. He can't gain the line. Settlers just stacked up the blue line. There's Caleb. Can't get a shot away. That'll do it. Three consecutive victories for the Statler Lightning. After a real tough start, they've handed the Silver Lake Wranglers their second consecutive defeat. Davin Natastad and company, three points in the HGHL standings. An absolute beauty here by Dylan Houston. That stood up as the go-ahead goal for a while, but Austin Kalev tied it back up. And then that's right here. But a late power play proves deadly for Stetler. Houston to fake the shot, the rebound, home. Kieran Ross, the winner. 3-2, the final. Bolts win it. Sylvan Lake out shoots Stetler 30 to 21 and in saying that 28 uh, 28 stops
for Davin Adisette. He's your third star. Dylan Houston, the captain. He's your second star in this one. Look at this beauty. Upstairs, shelf. Houston, goal and an assist. Your second star for the Statler Lightning. And your first star in this one is going to be Austin Caleb with a goal and an assist in this one, including this game tying goal that his boys couldn't uh, make stand up to count for uh, anything, even a point in the standings. But uh, nonetheless, the Silver Lake Wranglers, they got some soul searching to do. Lost uh, now three of their last four, two in a row in the Settler Lightning, who looked like uh, maybe this just uh, wasn't going to be their thing. And they were going to gel here in video game simulation world. Uh, indeed, they've come back and rallied, won three straight including uh, two over two pretty good teams, the Silver Lake Wranglers, and then, uh, of course, the Mountain View Colts as well. So, uh, Statler, uh, big victory here this evening uh, for a Thursday night. Uh, we will take our leave at this point. Uh, first, let's get you a scoring summary. Kyle Richmond, he opens the scoring. Five minutes and 37 seconds into this one, and then uh, just after that, uh, 30 seconds later, uh, 31 seconds later, to be exact, Ty Mulgrove ties it up. Austin Jacobs and Brendan Tucker on the assist the assist on the Richmond goal. We're Austin Caleb and Keith Bowen. Dylan Houston makes it 2-1. Statler at 12.48 from Riley Jacobson in the second. Then at 4.43, Austin Caleb ties it up from Brett Weston and Dayton Playford. But Kieran Ross has the, over, has the game winner, not the overtime winner, the game winner from Dylan Houston and Austin Jacobson on the power play at 14.37. All right, next up, for these two clubs, these two clubs will not be in action until Sunday. The Stetler Lightning are back at home. They're taking on the Red Deer Vipers. The Sylvan Lake Wranglers, they're back here, and they're taking on the Rocky Rams. Uh, tomorrow, we have the Three Hills Thrashers. They are in Rocky. Red Deer is in Mountain View. Uh, the Three Hills Rocky game, that puck drops at 6 o'clock, or 6.30, excuse me, Red Deer Mountain View will go at 8. Then on uh, Saturday, we'll go back to the South Division Coldale at High River Medicine Hat at Lomond, Okotoks at Cochrane. Uh, those respective puck drops are at 1 o'clock, 2.30 and 4. So thanks for tuning in. HGHL 21, my pleasure. We'll talk to you. Manana!